Today, Tucson's largest vaccination site on the University of Arizona campus transitioned to a state-run operation like those at State Farm Stadium and Phoenix Municipal Stadium here in the Valley. The move comes as several Arizona counties are forced to cancel vaccine appointments because of the bad weather that's crippling so much of the country, which has delayed deliveries. Team 12's Josh Sanders is live for us in Tucson on the U of A campus. And Josh, how are health officials handling these delays? Yeah, Mark, well, it was beautiful weather here in Tucson for the launch of the state's third mass vaccination site. And unlike its predecessors, this site has a walk up option. But like you mentioned with this weather, other Arizona counties are facing challenges when it comes to vaccine distribution. Southern Arizona now has its own mass vaccination site. It's kind of a nexus point for Tucson. The University of Arizona Tucson pod follows State Farm and Phoenix Municipal Stadium in mission to get Arizonans the COVID-19 vaccine. They're making it really easy to get in and out of here. The Tucson pod will eventually be able to operate 24-7 and serve up to 6,000 people per day. But for rural Arizona counties, the weather is causing issues. We know that there are shipping delays due to weather that the entire country is being impacted. The state has received shipments of the Pfizer vaccine with state pods like Tucson are using, but extreme weather is delaying shipments of the Moderna vaccine used by rural sites, even in U of A's backyard. 2,800 appointments at Tucson Medical Center, Tucson Convention Center, and Banner South could be postponed if new supplies don't arrive. And Coconino County had to postpone 1,800 appointments of the first dose. We're trying to maintain situational awareness and identify where potentially doses can be reallocated to, so that we don't have to cancel appointments. Now, Major, T. Michael Major Michael T. McGuire with the Arizona National Guard says at some point, the state hopes to bring pod locations like this to those rural counties like Yavapai and Coconino. We're live in Tucson. Josh Sanders, 12 News. Okay, Josh, thanks.